Hello guys, welcome back to Emily Property TV channel. In today's video, I'm going to share with you an amazing method that I'm using which allowing me to close many deals during my first start into my real estate business. If you are someone just and you don't have many listing to advertise, so using your friends or your colleagues listing to advertise but you don't, do not know how to increase your sales double by triple by five times by ten times this is the video that i don't think that you want to miss it because behind the scene i'm going to show you the method that i have been using it to close few hundred thousands of my income and i would like to disclose it and share it with you so how I use this method and it works for me and my team as well. Now, let me disclose the secret how I do it behind the scene. Even though today I don't have any listing, I'm using my friend's listing to advertise it. But when the leads come in, I know how to qualify it and I know how to ask a quality question to my client. By then, I, I know what the customer want, then I actually using this qualifying method to find the new listing between my network, my Cobrook network and immediately I can find some new property to match my client requirement. So let's go. This is lead coming in step by step tutorial for a new piece. There are three simple steps. Step number one, when a lead come in from your email, so you just need to go in to find who are the agents that giving you the list then you check the availability with the agents after that then you click in the listing to find out and you need to go through all the informations the size the property price and after that then you check the property status with the corporate agents whether the property is still available then only you communicate with your clients data the agent also tell me the problem of this property is hard to sell and is sink Next, I will key in the client contact into my phone book to WhatsApp them. Step 3, I will start to qualify the buyer by asking the qualifying questions. Usually, I will start with introductions about myself, send them the name cards and my profile. Here you go with some sample of questions that how I communicate with my client and how long already uh, they are looking for the properties and so on. Either they're buying the property for own use or they're buying for investment. Which location are they looking and what is the budget and the requirement they are looking for to find a new properties? Of course, there are many other more. It's depending on whether the clients will interact with you or not. Immediately after you got all the qualifying questions from your client, so what you can do is you need to gather all the information and try to identify whether this property is suitable for a client for viewing or not. If the answer is yes, then you will straight away make appointment with the clients to view the property. But if you find that actually the property is not suitable for this client, then you may divert the customer to another property by telling them that you may have other choice for them. The more clarity that you have, it will help you to identify a better customer requirement for you to identify a right property for them. The qualifying process need to practice and you need to master this provided that in the future you can immediately find the client suitable or not suitable to view the property. So this step is actually for you to save your time and also be more efficient by not wasting the customer and your time. With that, your client will feel that actually you are professional and they also love to give the business to you. So this is the reason why I'm setting up this video and help you to master the most important qualifying process for you to close more deals and become a top agent in real estate. Try to make a friends with your client during your qualifying process as well. So this will help you to close your deal faster in the future. If the client willing to give you more information, you will try to identify everything before you meet up with your client. So once you meet up with your client, then the client have confidence on you and will gain more trust from the customer in the future. The above three step is actually using by the top real estate agents in the market. 